In this video, we're gonna talk about Auto from Another World, episode 10. Hmm. Wanna justify the uh, cheers video? But anyway, keep on watching. Let me remind you guys that uh, we are now on the road to this anime spinani. So uh, we, we got those anything can happen feels right now. And this episode, yep, it's no different. So, first order of business, the thumbnail. Probably the most uh, the most compromising position I've seen Elf uh, Yeah, in this anime <laughs> And it's all because of oji <laughs> san If you're, if you've been following this anime since the very beginning You know that uh, hindi naman likas na Hindi naman li likas na pervert si ano eh, si, si oji san Talagang during that time he was only 18 And he's uh uh, he's, a, he's an OG gamer, so, and he's a bit anti-social. Kaya yung, yung pakikitungo niya sa mga babae, eh, parang, yeah, eh, whatever the fuck he wants. Kaya, ito ang mga nagiging consequences. So with that in mind, let's get to the nitty-gritty of this episode. Thanks! Maraming comic elements ang episode na to. And if you're going to, uh, you're going to slow it down, malay. Uh, it might suffer the same fate as episode 9. The pacing um, helped this episode make up for um, make up for his poor make up for the poor performance of the previous one. Do I have complaints? Uh, number one. No, absolutely not. Sakto yung pacing ng episode na to. Also time it was slow. Kasi maganda yung build up niya towards the um, yeah, to towards the Towards the towards its uh its comic moments, kaya sakto na I tell you guys, sakto na. Flow naman. First gear shift here was when Otisan almost erased the memories of um si Pushimi at si Chiaki. It was hilarious, okay? But for me, this is a no-brainer of a gear shift. Bakit? It triggered the backstory. Second gear shift was when Oji-san sneak massages Elf. He really does things on its on, on his own, and this gear shift proves that. Pero this gear shift also led to our thumbnail. Final gear shift was when Elf saw um saw the improvised laundry post na kilawa ng ano ng ng mga kasama ng hero. Siyempre, sambayan. Well, for me, that's a no-brainer of a gearship post. Kasi, I see this gearship uh, as a trigger for the final three episodes. Right after, uh, right after Elf left, ayun, nagkaroon na lang, nagkaroon na lang, uh, tumaligo na lang sila, oh, Jesus, nakita na, nasusunog na yung in. So these three gear shifts that I saw, guys, don't just watch these three gear shifts. Watch the entire episode. Bakit? Because this episode is the gateway to the final three episodes. Mga sinet up na tayo, right? As early as uh, as early as the second half of the uh, uh, of the episode. So. Uh, if you're going to miss out by watching just these three gear shifts, wala ka. Uh, I, or, fair warning guys, okay? Fair warning. Plot wise. Vintage uncle. So, Plantado ang plot, guys! It's a well ordered up plot! Kasi! Uncle from Another World has been doing this since episode 1! Dahil! Uh, mostly, kinikwento talaga ni, uh, ni Oji-san yung kanya mga adventures and misadventures do, dun sa kabilang mundo. Alright? Uh, remember, Uncle from Another World is a reverse isikai. 
kasi galing sa fantasy world yung PD. Uh, after 17 years, he comes out of his coma. Ayun. He's, uh, he starts uh, relating his stories to, to his nephew. So, I couldn't see uh, this anime going through a clean plot anymore. Dahil, eh, final three episodes na eh. So, ituloy-tuloy mo na pag-i-implantado ang mga plot. Alright? Kasi, daming backstories eh. Backstory sequences are usually boring. Kung walang uh, break back into the main continuity, wala. Aantok yun ang mga viewer. So, they're searching in uh, kumaga, intermissions para hindi mag-bore tayo. Tayo mga manunood. Alright? So it's okay to have a have a long backstory sequence. After all, Ojisan is telling a story here. Okay, uh, that's a, that's the theme of this anime. Yeah, I got the complaints as to the plot of this episode. Okay, talagang uh, this anime is now known for that. Okay, so pace flowing plot. They all came together for this episode, folks. Talagang. Yeah, um, this anime totally made up for its uh, for its debacle in episode nine. I almost got uh, I almost got bored to death. So <laughs> episode nine. So also from another world, episode ten. Dessert. Two loves the, uh, uh, the scene that saved uh, this episode from getting from suffering the same fate as episode 9 was that scene that uh, that triggered our thumbnail. <laughs> Talaga na tawa ako sa sa ikselan yun eh. This is this is the drawback of of, of Oji San's personality, of 18 year old Oji San's personality. Kasi well uh, during the uh, during the 90s. Gamers tend to be antisocial, okay? So this anime uh, is quite relatable uh, with that aspect. Kaya, uh, how they deal with people, uh, what you call this? Uh, face to face. Wala eh. Sablay, sablay talaga eh. Right? Ojisan uh, shows, shows this in, uh, what you call this? Very clearly, okay? This was the drawback of gamers during the 90s. Ako, inaamin ko. Okay? Uh, I, w- I was a gamer before, from uh, from the late 90s to the early 2000s. Talaga medyo, medyo naging, uh, what's called this? Ayaw ko nang uh, maki, makihalubino sa mga tao. I don't want to, uh, yeah, I just, I just want to stay at home and just uh, play my games or go to the mall playing my games. Right? That kind of life sucks. Okay? And this anime is going to tell you how uh, how pathetic your personality can be uh, if you if you follow Oji-san's lead. 18-year-old uh, Oji-san's lead. So yeah, there is a moral lesson to be learned here. So, what do we do now? Well, the final three episodes are now coming up. Let's just wait for that. In the meantime, watch the next review.